George liked visiting Professor Wiseman because she was the only person he knew who worked under a whale. I know those knocks. Come on in, guys. Wow, what's that? My hobby. Working on complex things relaxes me. Oh. Have you ever seen such a beautiful clock, George? If you like it now, watch what happens every hour. <laughs> so, what do you think? Very impressive. <laughs> I'm glad you liked it, George. Oh, we should go. The rocket presentation is starting soon. Are you coming with us, George? Or do you want to stay here and watch the clock? <laughs> <laughs> well, if it's okay with Professor Wiseman, it's okay with me. Now, if you want to see the little people play again, move the minute hand once around to 12. <laughs> Have fun. How long does it take to build a clock like that? Oh, about three years. Oh, that reminds me. I'll be right back. George, be a good little monkey. Exactly. George wanted to see the little people again. When you take something apart, it's a good idea to pay attention to what went where. Where could George find out how a clock's parts go together? The library. Of course. What's a little monkey like you doing in a huge clock like this? Well, would you like me to help you? Okay, and this goes there. Now, you see? <gasps> what a beautiful clock. Did you make it? <laughs> I know everything about clocks, but not one thing about understanding monkey. <laughs> well, be more careful in the future, eh? Time is a precious thing. Compass? What have we said about bringing pigeons indoors, George? Oh, it's all right. Are you showing him my clock? <laughs> well, go ahead. George, how did this heavy metal toolbox get so... <laughs> <laughs> 